Yum, yum! Floyd here with a quick look at creating an icosahedron from a cube in Plasticity. Start with the new scene and move the default cube to the origin. By pressing the G key on the keyboard to activate the move tool, press F for freestyle and right click twice. Create a two segment line in the shape of a V with a 21 degree angle that snaps to the top and middle of one side of the cube. Mirror the new curve vertically, then mirror both curves horizontally to create four curves. Select the cube, followed by the curves, and press C to cut the cube with the curves. Then delete the four corner solids. Rotate the four curves 90 degrees with the pivot at the origin, then rotate it 90 degrees around the z-axis. Cut the cube with the curves and delete the corner solids. Rotate the four curves 90 degrees with the pivot at the origin, then rotate it 90 degrees around the y-axis. Cut the cube again with the curves and delete the corner solids. Use the line tool to create a triangle with each point snapping to the points on the main solid like so. Mirror the triangle curve horizontally, then mirror both tries vertically. Mirror all four tries to create a total of eight triangles. Then use the imprint curve feature with the method set to normal to slice the tries onto the main solid. Select these three faces and use the keyboard shortcut Shift X to remove them. Then select the solid and use the patch holes command to create a face. Repeat this process for each of the remaining seven three-face pyramid topology until you have a finished icosahedron. Oh, look at the time. <laughs>